Yeah, I, I want to say something about Square Enix. They need to stop. They need to fucking stop. You know, I was just enjoying Final Fantasy VII Remake, but I have an understanding that it's only going to be exclusive for a short period of time. But this, what they did at the PS... I, I forgot to talk about this when I was talking about the PS5 Live event. What kind of company makes a trailer for their next game and says designed exclusively for PlayStation 5, then turns around and re-uploads the trailer edited to their own YouTube channel and then announces the game as coming to PS5 and PC. What kind of a company lies like that? That way, especially about the exclusivity of a product, that was the most ridiculous garbage I'd ever seen. I never want to, exp- I, I never want to see a company pull off something like that again. I never want to see a company pull off something like that again. See, seeing my intelligence insulted like that, Especially with my constantly degrading mind, almost puts me off wanting to buy Project Athia. I'm at the point where I don't want the game anymore. If you don't want this game to be exclusive, be upfront about it. Don't fucking lie to fans like you did at that event. That was disgusting. You need to be ashamed of yourselves for that. Ooh. Just thinking about it, it gets me really red. And it's, what, almost 90 degrees out here. Ooh. Oh, that pisses me off. You have no idea. Square. Do not do this again. Yours one out. <laughs>